everyone, sorry about that. Seems Europa decided to crash on me, because why not, right? Please, sorry. Okay, so for some reason that battle went a lot worse this time around. Let's just crush these guys already. Look, I have a rival, Bachmanis, gain gold, uh, gain gold wouldn't be a bad idea, but... So, what we'll do, we'll Good news is we got that ticking war score started already. That is just more troops. And you guys go over there. As well, go over here. We will siege through hopefully all of this pretty quickly. Um, and where is. Where is you? What is you doing? You is taking a lot of time doing not much. You guys are colonizing, which is fine. Awesome, so sieges finish up quickly. It's the nice thing about having a lot of troops is that you can actually, like, just sort of carpet siege a bunch of areas and cut them all off. So all these are finished. Light bulb, uh, offensive. Yeah, let's go with extra siege ability. That's gonna be nice. The sieges are suddenly going to go a lot quicker. As we can see by all of them going a lot quicker there. Convert places to my religion, but I really can't just because of, uh, This army will form back up into a 30,000 stack as well. You just hang out here. I would like to do, I would like to get Uruguay, as well as some more land from here, as well as perhaps force them to stop being at war with Spain. Stop being allied to Spain. Enemy sieges. Those are the only ones of any note. That's the only army of any note here so far. And once we squish them, shouldn't have any more problems, hopefully. Part 
Tier efficiency goes up. I like that. So you go up there as well. And you guys go in there. That's the question. Fourteenth. really love for you guys to finish your sieges just because I need to start attacking. At the very least, I need to group up my army. But let's just group up. Let's go down here. We'll try and finish up these sieges. And then keep moving north. Uh, so that's fine. Yeah, that's Spain's troops helping out. Forty-nine percent. You should take over and like right now. Awesome. Okay, so then I'll let you go up here. Uh, reinforcing is taking a bit of time. If we just sort of move up this way, I think we can swing through and then take over all of that territory in, in time. Trade ideas, uh, yeah, sure. Get an extra merchant there as well. Uh, where is this? Okay, Brazil, Amazonas. So we want to be to collect in Brazil. Actually, I think I probably need to move my trade node somewhere, but I'm not sure how to exactly work trade at things. is that these guys are not regaining morale very well. Tier efficiency goes up, I like that. Can actually go up there. 
off. I wonder if that is perhaps what is causing me to not gain morale back. Uh, their armies are up there. You're really gonna march down? Oh, okay. Okay, if that's what you think the smartest thing to do is. Wondering if I should perhaps swing my army around and take out these guys up here while I still not have a chance, obviously, but let this episode run sort of full length there, uh, just because of the crap it was that cut out. The previous episode cut out, obviously. 29th, you'll be there on the 24th. I don't like losing stability, because stability is even more expensive than inflation. You guys are... Western tech, actually. So you're just a vassal? Yeah, you're just a vassal now. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. You guys are seeking for that, whatever. must have just become Western Tech, actually. I'd love to get that extra discipline and army morale. Up and going at some point. You... Three advisor. Lose some money, sure, but that's sort of acceptable. You guys will siege through these. For instance, this guy, if you could siege through your. No? Okay. These, though, are doing well. That's nice. Uh, Navy is. Where the hell are you, Navy? Where the hell over there? What are you doing? Well, I mean, I know you're exploring Australia, but it's just its just inconvenient. Stop it. Behave yourself. Yeah, that's fine. I can gain five years of nationalism. It's not going to matter all that much. Siege of 
Pombo is over. Divide our army up into two. So half of you go here, and half of you. Half of you go left, half of you go right, I suppose is what I'd say. Everybody's showing up, all the Europeans are showing up to the party now. Uh, Spanish Louisiana, anybody else over there? And we'll just sort of sweep through here, kill everybody, siege these. To try and go up there, kill New Spain too, if I can. Don't have anything better to do? Ottomans, me, and Spain. Hey, I have more troops in Spain. Go figure, huh? Been my goal all along. our way up this way. And those two, I can actually stop them from coming in it down here, and actually that might be a good idea if I move you to here and then divide up one of these armies to siege everything else. Speed a bit. That's fine. You will finish this siege in a moment. You. Start dividing everybody. Ah, uh, that's fine. You know what, we'll just spam the rest of them. Weren't really helping me that much anymore anyway, so... Suffer a little bit more attrition this way, but also siege through a lot of this a lot faster. Okay. 
Siege has come along well. Not seeing a lot in the way of troops that can... Or fleets that are actually going to be able to be transport... Or that are going to be transporting troops. Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. It's fine. I lost a bunch of sieges. That's all right. troops down there that are actually able to start sieging anything. You go to a mapa. Uh, there's a decent number of troops there, but... And then basically we're just going to do the same thing, sort of come up here, block everything off. Military, I'm behind on military ideas again, so I'm just going to hold on and wait. Hey, colony became self-sustaining. That is awesome. You then... You are going this way. I should like to send you over to here. I'll gain a bunch of money. Lose two war exhaustion. I like that as well. Seize this colony, and then we'll go over here as well. That way I can just abandon that if, uh... Actually, yeah, we'll just abandon it now, I suppose. Then once these are sieged through... We'll come up here... catch up with them. And I actually should probably go and catch up with them now while I'm...
They have enough troops and I want to be able to crush them while I still... troops and still okay let's do this uh, take all of the land that I have claims on please were lost. Oh, right. All my boats were gone. Okay. Fifty-three thousand troops is a lot of pain in the ass to deal with. At least they are very slowly replenishing, which is nice. siege and get in a position to assist, then Fully. Soon as well. Here. Kind of would like to force them to attack me somewhere.
Okay, now, are you still gonna march this way or no? That's what I'm thinking I can do. Pause, hold on. Stop. Fifth of August. March, Force March. Okay, this should be able to kill everybody here. And then I'm gonna follow you down and wipe the whole stack, because I am getting sick and tired of your bullshit. Uh, you're going to Z Z Zaraza now. Oh, they're probably going here, aren't they? If I just had one boat, I could wipe the entire army. Man. I wouldn't give to have some boats. But alas. So what we'll do, we'll just leave our entire army basically here. Everybody stop for us marching. And you just go up here and start switching through stuff. Helpful to get. Dragoon. We're at 26 for that tech. This humanist idea's tolerance of heretics goes up. That's nice. Enforcements, but uh, still has a lot of money. Sort of siege back all my provinces here. Still to trap a well. I'm not trapping. I need. Uh... Let's actually see what they will offer me. Where's most of their war score coming from? Just give me all of that, and then I want you to annul treaties with where is Spain. Spain. So you're not willing to give me that, and then give me a bunch of money, so nope. I will just finish sieging through all of these. 
I'll take what I want anyway. Very disappointed I couldn't uh, actually do something about that to, you know, keep them trapped on this shitty piece of land. Spain is going over there, so I do want to have an army over that way. So we kill that army before they even get a chance to do anything. Siege through all the rest of my territory here. on December 7th. The nice thing, you see, I can catch these armies without really them Getting much in the way of uh, traction here. Okay, so uh, you guys group up and then go. be resieged or desieged I suppose and then my armies can group back up technology yep I'll take that change to an absolute monarchy, unrest, discipline, autonomy change. I think absolute monarchy will be the best way for me to go at the moment. Uh, constitutional monarchy, manpower recovery, autonomy, legitimacy. Yeah, I think I'm going to go absolute monarchy once I get 100, uh, 100 admin points. see what Portugal has to give me. Do you want to give me what I want? Still don't. Okay. I uh, will do stability of this. It's currently in the maximum 25 war score. We will slowly get some more war score as we end up uh, sieging through the rest of these, because you look at all of theirs is just from sieges. And once they stop occupying these, which they will stop very shortly, I think we'll actually be able to squeeze them for what we want. Hey, peace. Which, well, I don't know, maybe that was a good idea, maybe that was a bad idea. I feel like I should have gone and sieged through New Spain or something, but I did not. Can I pay back this loan yet? Uh, this loan yet, repay 447, I cannot. So the Panama Canal with a billion gold. Okay. Twenty-five 
25 army tradition or 54,000 manpower. I think the army tradition is actually going to be better for me. The manpower I can recover pretty quickly. So by the time that I actually go to war next time, I'll get my manpower back. CB against Great Britain. It's fine. And I know this episode is going really long, but uh, I figure I owe it to you guys after that short episode last time. Um, that's all up there. We don't care about that. So, let's see, uh, France, do you want out? No, you don't, okay. Portugal. Awesome, uh, unrest. Let's make everything into the core. And then let's also do this and lower uh, oh shit that's not what I wanted to do but let's speed that up huh few revolts on your hands. Banda. So that, that, and Rayu. Rayu is there. Okay, so those three. So what we'll do Simple missions colonize. Koto Ramis is where? Koto Ramis is that one. Well, I can't colonize that. Cancel it immediately. Colony's doing okay. That is frustrating. as well as this. All right, so we will wrap this one up here very soon, I suspect. 
just basically getting at this point to make more of these cores. problematically are all going in the same direction. How old is my heir anyway? You are 18? Awesome. So... I'm actually a decent leader too. How old are you? 63. Okay. Hoping that he dies pretty soon just because I would really very much like to uh, to get a good leader on the throne, somebody who can actually boost my tech a bit. tax. Uh, I'd rather get those, I think. Money should clear up as well once we get into position. And then everything is busy building an earthen rampart, which should finish up soon. Trade efficiency, autonomy change. Let's go with that one. Okay, so what we'll do, we'll pick this up next time uh, as I continue to fabricate claims on everybody I can. Hey, we've almost gotten all of uh, Rio de Plata wiped out. Just gotta focus the rest on Portuguese Brazil, and then we should be good to go, actually, afterwards. You guys are colonializing. Okay. Colonial regions, that is. Colonial Mexico, so we don't even wanna screw with that at the moment. Go up there. Oh no, we were discovered. Alright, so uh, we will pick this up next time. I am Manic Mink. This is European Universalis 4, and we'll see you later. Take care.